If you're new here, you know we talk kicks once a week. I interact with the people on my IG and TikTok daily, man. You can find me on there. Let's get straight to it, though. The lies they tell us. I keep telling y'all the lies. They said they was done with Yeezys last year. I could have swore. I, I vividly remember that. Adidas apparently has more Yeezy stock and a bunch of it. Yeezy day is approaching. Matter of fact, let me ask y'all this. Do y'all care for Yeezy still? I didn't think so. Uh, Yeezy Day is back June 3rd, all the way to June 13th. It's a lot dropping. I feel like they got everything on the list. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I don't really care for none of this shit. I'm going to be totally, totally honest. But, 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 I'm not going to even cap. I might try for the Zebras. I'm definitely going to be trying for the Yeezy boots. I'm mad I missed out on the Yeezy boots back when they came out. I think that is a top five boot that that just go with everything. Top five boot of all time. Yes, that's a hot take. Uh, other than that, I'm not really caring about half of this stuff, but it looks like they got everything. I see Turtle Doves on the list. Wave Runners on the third team. Hey, I'm shooting for that. Ugh. It's a lot. A lot of money is going to be spent, but... Only about two releases on here. I can say I really care about that. But let me know in the comments if y'all care about Yeezy still. Uh, or y'all just done with that era. I'm 50-50 on it. I ain't gonna lie. I gotta see what my money at. But Yeezy Day is approaching if you dare want some Yeezys. Like, I don't think y'all honestly give a fuck about them today. I ain't gonna even lie. Uh, they didn't got my boy. I'm not gonna lie. Cool Kai will pay $1 million to Nike to settle lawsuit. I mean, I think we all seen it. This is old news pretty much, but this is finally, finally this chapter is over with. Uh, I'm pretty sure my mans can bounce back. He ain't tripping on it because I'm looking on his IG. He still look like he's still going at it with him. I don't know. Do what you want with that information. Uh, I'm not going to message him or nothing like that. But uh, they say he got to stop making these. I don't know like the crazy, crazy details, but they say he got to stop making these. He got to pay a million dollars. I like these a lot. I understand at the same time. I totally get it. I'm I'm in the middle with it. You know what I mean? Like it's like I like the shoe. I get it from Nike. Coming from like the Bape side and then with the Sue and people. I get it. Look like it. I no 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 last though. We you can't deny it. It's identical. But it's just like damn. Nike was not playing with motherfuckers. Him, Bape, other creators, uh Omni, like, bro, they was not playing with these dudes in the last, what, two years? Wish the best for them, though, man. New Balance news. Action Bronson is getting more New Balance. I think it's probably like his fifth, sixth collab. If you want to then call it a collab at this point. Uh, they're calling these the specializing in life. Uh, these is okay. These are solid. I don't like how they look. I, oh, I'm assuming this is a girl wearing these. She wearing them kind of funky, but this angle right here looks pretty good. Uh, they solid. I'm not too crazy about them. Will I be shooting for them? Absolutely, probably not. Uh, like I said, I don't know if it's just me. My man is still like, I can't pay $200 for New Balance. I just can't. I can't. I can't. Fire shoe. Do like the shoe. But I just, I used to get them on sale all the time. And I just cannot see myself spending $200 on New Balance. That's just me. But. On to the next. More New Balance news. The New Balance 860 V2. They call this the Silver Pack. Uh, these are definitely those New Balance that the people used to say old people wear. This is an old person New Balance. I'm not a fan of these. Uh, okay colorways, but the model definitely gives me old people vibes. Uh, it really ain't too much to say about them. <laughs> Be honest with you. Uh something about my grandma but uh i don't think these are too crazy people won't make no noise they'll likely be available oh my god the lies the lies the lies i could have swore they said they was done with the travis jordan one last year we got news of this little new mocha colorway but apparently my god <laughs> We are getting two more colorways in 2025. Now, my opinion, they solid. Uh, you got this white cream colorway, cream swoosh, and this white brown pink swoosh. Solid. 
it's solid but golly i am tired of this chapter we are in like i just want them to do like a wide spread where they make 500k to a million pair of travis's and get this shit over so everybody i it need to get to the point that everybody can say they got a pair i don't think we dare yet we still got some work to do yes the sneaker world is healing but golly can everybody say they got a pair of travis's and get this wave over with if not do another model y'all burnt the jordan one out it's burnt the fuck out we need something new it's it need something refreshing like god fucking lead like i'm, I'm tired i'm tired I'm tired. Do something else, Nike. I'm not talking about this shit no more. For my shorties. I mean, I can't really say shorties. <laughs> we the ones who grew up watching SpongeBob, but SpongeBob and Croc is doing a collab. Uh, these are solid. The ones that stand out to me is the Patrick ones. Uh, would I be shooting for these? Absolutely not. I'm not against it though. Not gonna lie, somebody bought me like a gift. Uh, I definitely wear these. But um, if you like Crocs, SpongeBob and Croc is doing a collab. Seems pretty cool. Thumbs up. New Kobe's on the way. Kobe 8 Pro Tro to be exact. They're calling this the Champagne Colorway. These are solid. These is clean. I like these a lot. I always say Kobe's are good summer shoes. This is white tee nice shorts throw these kobe's on white socks i don't know he got black socks in the picture do what you want with that i don't care how you rock them but this is a solid colorway i like these a lot uh super clean uh the fuck the hoopers uh i might let y'all have this i'm not like super 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 crazy about these but this is a solid colorway uh kobe's getting a little bit outrageous for me that's another one like i did say the sneaker world is healing we need we, we're, we're doing a damn good job market is dead pretty much dead a lot of shoes are sitting we need to go back to that era where kobe's was sitting yes i i, I came from that i know that kobe's my favorite player all the time i got kobe's on sale all the fucking time i should not have a hassle of getting some kobe's bro it's time to stop making them like limited or just low quantities and make sure everybody can get up here like let this colorway came out when he was alive rest in peace to mamba y'all would not buy these motherfuckers they would be on the shelf but y'all know when they release it's gonna be hell trying to get them first look at the jordan six paris olympics uh we seen the mock-ups with him and the dude with the shitty pics is back it looks like he got a good camera this time too uh xc sneaker he infamous for make, taking shitty pics but this time he took some solid pics uh be honest with you they okay there's not a bad colorway don't really care for them though being honest uh they cool uh balls pearls on the laces a little crazy to me not gonna eat cap but they not bad though they super clean i kind of fuck with them though but outlet specials guarantee facts we have a new jordan one coming out in 2025 they call these the washington wizards or the deep blue royal jordan ones uh this is just a mock-up, by the way. Uh, what's that? Union collab, wannabe shoes, uh, outlet specials. I can see it now. I don't know. Is it just me? Every time they drop like a blue Jordan one, it kind of go below the radar. Uh, this is just a mock-up. These, I'm these not catching my attention. Uh, we can only do so much with a with a mock-up until we see actual pics of the shoe. I don't give a shit. On to the next. Work Kobe's are coming out in the near future. The WNBA vibe Kobe 8 orange. Uh, I like these. These are solid. Nice summer shoe. I don't really have too much to say about these. Just the orange and the white of Kobe. Expect the worst. We have a Nike Dunk SB for my SB boys. The Seattle Supersonics colorway is coming out near the holidays. Now, I'm not going to lie. I don't really like sbs y'all know that i didn't said that plenty of times on all my pages and platforms but these are solid not gonna even lie these are clean looks like it come with three laces two la three laces um this is clean i ain't gonna even lie i don't even like sbs but i i will fake get these i'm not gonna even lie like i don't know the i don't know if they're gonna be limited or anything i don't think so i think it's just colorway these ain't these ain't nothing too crazy to be like make them limit limited uh but these is fire though i'm not gonna lie my sb boys i know y'all shooting for these like this is definitely solid uh we got some nba news y'all know i love my ball pause um 
Kauri debuts the new Anta Kai one, the Chief Hila. These is fire. Like, these is hard. Uh, I'm not too crazy about, like, the little skirt they got on the back. Yeah, I get it what it is. I'm not going to disrespect them. I'm not like that. But, uh, these is fire. Super fire. Um, I got a hot take, too. If we talk about just, like, new shoes for the year, top 10 shoes of the year, you can make a debate that Kyrie has a top 10 shoe of the year, if not top 10. Honorable mention for sure. These is fire. I've I, I I've not seen one Kyrie that was bad. They've been making some noise. They clean. Nice colorways. Uh, I think this is like a PE version for him. But these is hard. Like I like these a lot. Uh, will we see them in the future? It don't say yet. But I like these. For NBA news, Ant debuts the Slime Green AE1 Low. After getting his ass cooked the whole game. I sure was looking at these motherfuckers. These is fire. I can't wait till the lows come out, man. Look, I'm going to continue to say. Shoe of the year. It's not, I, I don't even think it's close, bro. Well, y'all let me know. Should I do like a half? Oh, nah, I think that's too too early. I was thinking about doing a halfway video for shoes of the year. But we, might, we might leave that for the end of the year. But y'all comment. What do y'all think is the shoe of the year? Like, be for real. I know a lot of y'all might go, Brent for real, man. No, I think the AEs. We talking about new shoes, innovative. Technically, the Brent for is a, a, a reimagined is a new shoe. So that is a debate. But I got AEs. It's not even close to me. So uh, y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think the shoe of the year is. I mentioned another video that I love these Skepta Pumas. The Skepta guy that y'all say, y'all put me on in the comments. I definitely read y'all comments. Like, we on the road to 100K. The comments do help the channel. The Skepta guy, that's with Puma that did a collab with Puma. He says Nike's been treating him like an influencer, meaning he ain't like the way they was, uh, you know, managing him and shit like that. Basically, they wasn't giving them no royalties and none of that shit. Pretty much, he ain't had no control of what the fuck he was doing. Um, he pretty much tweeted, my shoes selling out again. Much, much better deal. Now I get royalties from the shoes, so thank you, everybody on the shoe journey with me literally my dream comes true he deserves it i arguably got these for shoe of the not shoe of the year but top 10 or in that honorable mention these is fire to me am i the only one that like these skeptic pumas these are super hard uh he definitely deserves it uh i guess nike wasn't treating them right because i'm not gonna even cap never was tapped in with them like i said i was reading y'all comments y'all tapped me in with them i did some research on them I don't even remember half these shoes he did with Nike at all. Like, I didn't even know these was, like, his shoe. Uh, he definitely deserves what he getting with Puma, though. He killed it with these. Gordon Brand is bringing back the Laser 4. My grail is the Laser 4 from 2005. I still don't have that shoe. Uh, I can't get it right now, but would I wear a 20 year old shoe? No, you got to get swapped restorations and shit. i don't feel like doing all that but one of my grills the laser series is coming back out in 2025 uh i'm curious how does it look i've always been a big fan of the laser series uh jordan brand does this is just a mock-up of them uh these are solid this is solid i'm pretty sure this ain't going what they i'm pretty sure this this is not what they're gonna actually look like but if it is close to that i'm cool with that these is actually fire uh i love to see actual pics of these mischief is back at it again with the new shoes uh i've shitted on mischief so many times deservingly so they know what they be doing out here with the crazy stuff but i'm not gonna lie this new shoe the soccer shoe wavy outsole these is kind of fire i'm not gonna even lie when i personally wear them i don't know and they look uncomfortable as fuck. Uh, let me know in the comments if y'all got some mischief shoes or are they comfortable. Uh, I don't know. Wavy soles just look like they gonna hurt my motherfucking feet all day. But they look cool though. I'm not gonna even lie. Uh, I don't know the retail form. Mischief fake be taxing though. I'm not gonna even lie. Expect like 150 to 200. Because they always come with like a funny box and some accessories. So I'm assuming like 200. But yeah, these is... This is kind of dope. I'm not going to even lie. Last news of the day. Louis Vuitton is stepping into the croc world. They are calling these the shark clogs. Uh, not going to eat cow. These, they fired at me. I know some. I, I seen the guy that was shitting on me in my other video. Oh, you like crocs, but you don't. Yes, nigga. I like crocs. These is fire. Uh, 
I like to be comfortable. I'm in the comfortable state right now. And these shark clogs by Louis Vuitton is super fire. Now, would I pay the price for these? Absolutely not. I don't know the retail for these, but it's Louis Vuitton. Expect seven fifty and up. <laughs> these look like a thousand dollars plus. Uh, but I like these. These are fire. I love the colors, like a fade to white. Super clean. The yellow one, cool. And they got this white one. Fire. Let me know in the comments if y'all like these. I think it's just me. And that's it for the day, man. You know, once a week we talk kicks. You can find me on my IG and TikTok. I'm always talking to the people. We talking about shoes nine out of ten times. Or so if you just want to chop it up with me, I appreciate it, man. We on a road to 100K, man. Like, subscribe, everything. It helps grow the channel. Until next time.